Hello friends and my dear colleagues. Today I will show you how to create an assignment tab for the Google Forms, uh, where student can submit the handwritten assignment. So we'll see where to submit, where to collect the responses, how to check them manually, so that you get all the uh, score according to the roll number wise. After watching the video, you can able to create a Google uh, assignment form. Uh, you can able to share with the students where exactly uh, you can share. Uh, you can also check the assignments manually and how to score them according to the roll number. Lots of uh, staff is facing problem regarding how to create the assignment tab and where to put the question paper. I come across uh, also uh, same problem. So I have find out one solution how to do that. So number one thing, uh, where to share the question paper and uh, how. So go to your Google Classroom. In your Google Classroom, you will be sharing the uh, question paper as assignment or quiz assignment. Don't share like that. Share it in a PDF format. Prepare the Word file, convert into a PDF file and share it as a material, not in any other place. So that it becomes easy easy for a student to take uh, that paper. So I'm going to my this is my demo class. So I'm going there in the class room. I'm going to select the material, and in the material, <coughs> give the heading. Sessional question paper and add the file over here. I have already created the PDF file. So this is the PDF file. I will be selecting by going directly to my class Because when we create an assignment or quiz assignment type, the problem is student can also submit over there their answers. In they can submit in the question paper also. They can submit in different different places. The, the good best way is to put it in the uh, this thing material tab. So go to this one. PDF and select that. This is my PDF. I will upload that PDF under the material tab. Not in the quiz or not in the quiz assignment tab. Plain material question paper. Here uh, in the schedule, you can give the timing where we want to uh, schedule it so i want to schedule it tomorrow uh, like 9 so it will be visible to them at 9 only exactly it will be automatically they will going to get the mail now after that we'll go to a google drive for creating the assignment tab don't go from the Google Classroom or anything directly go from the Google Drive for creation of so this is my question paper I already created it and keep it uh, kept it ready for upload so all please do that that was a mock uh, question paper now after opening the Google go to your Google Drive After going to the Google Drive,
go to new <coughs> under the new go to more select google forms So first start with the giving title. After going to the Google file where you created the form put the name give the name uh, of specific paper or sessional paper or question paper and then start uh, writing the question like roll number make it compulsory make sure that you are keeping selecting the short answer over here then after that roll number if you want the name otherwise otherwise it's fine just name make it required or not required or make it required if you are putting it and then the submit tab or upload tab create it and in that select the file upload option in the file upload option there are number of files you can accept so majorly or mainly pdf file but we can also in case of any problem with the student if they don't have the scanner and all those things so select the uh, allow the image also to up for the upload number of files we are restricting to only one but in case for any casualties or any problem with the uh, technical issue with the student select maximum five keep it 10 mb file okay <clears throat> yesterday i have taken the examination so maximum the file goes up to 3 mb so 10 mb is more than enough make it compulsory and that's it that is your ready now under the setting options collect the email addresses so student have to write the email addresses and limit to one response so only they can able to submit only one person at the one time and uh, in the presentation tab uh, shuffle the this question and all those things no need in the quiz option if don't if you're not making uh, don't make it as quiz uh, because uh, we don't want to release the marks and all those things so make don't make it as a quiz put it off and just save it by clicking collect the email address and limit to one response and make click the save option now your file is ready or your <coughs> submission tab is ready for uh, sharing now how to share it don't share it in the google uh, uh, quiz quiz tab or quiz assignment tab go to send option under the send option there is a link over here shorten the url copy this copy this and by copying it go to your google classroom and under the stream option we have classroom people and marks under the stream option just click over here and copy paste your link now same link you can also schedule over here post schedule and save draft so go to the schedule select the timing we have prepared the question paper schedule at 9 so keep its time around 9 10 or something like that so then 10 minutes they will write and then the link will be active so they will know it where to upload so scheduling it so exactly tomorrow uh, 9 uh, 10 it will be released for the students so this is how you will be uh, making the file and sharing with the students the same file the way we have shared with the stream option you can share in the whatsapp also so um, but as uh, this is better to share it from here where the student will get the question paper on the same place and the link on the same place 
now how to evaluate this uh, yesterday i have conducted one mock so this is how the file will look like so roll number and uh, uh, this roll number i have created this is the file link of the student they have uh, uh, uploaded now just create add this into this one <coughs> column insert a new column like this and this will be your score option so you can give the score so right here score okay now we know this is the roll numbers these are the file uploads so just click uh, open the single single file from here so this is how i'm opening it will going to open where you can check the answers of the students at the same time so this is will open so hold on Now this is it will open where you can uh, check all the answers in the question paper hmm now this is how they have uploaded it sometimes it will be the image will be like this make sure that they have mentioned the roll number and all those things so this is how they have uploaded the questions now by looking at the questions uh, we can know how many marks we have to give evaluate it and close this and from where you have we have opened this one part so directly you go and give him or give her the marks according so this is how you will be checking it after the checking you get the roll number score just copy this and paste it in the mark sheet this is how you will be preparing a mark sheet manually and releasing it later for the session mark so thank you for watching uh